Hi, I'm Kira. I'm a final year law student from Pentasligo and I'm running to be your Welfare and Equality Officer for next year. Three years ago I made the great decision of becoming a member of the Welfare Crew and since then I've served as Welfare Crew Secretary and this year as Gender Equality Coordinator on the Students' Union. I believe that my experience and passion for student welfare and the fight for equality make me the best possible candidate for this position. In this video I'm going to outline some of my ideas and you can check the rest out of my manifesto. The findings of the My World Mental Health Survey show that one in every four students will suffer a mental health difficulty during their time in university. This is why it's vital in a campus of over 24,000 students that more are safe talked about. This is suicide alertness for everyone and it will train you to be a trained listener and a peer support for your friends and classmates. This can be sponsored and done for free. Currently the counselling service in UCD is backed up. This is a vital service that no student should ever have to wait for. That's why I'm proposing that we use the money that which has been ring-fenced for student services by the HEA to restructure and reform the counselling service. This means bringing in extra counsellors during busy periods and ensuring that students on the waiting list can seek external support and be reimbursed the price. There isn't one student at the university who hasn't been affected at one time or another by financial hardships. I will ensure that all financial funds are able to be applied for online, making the process much more convenient and much quicker. I will also launch a student budgeting app, which will be available online and on your smartphone. It will have the SU shop prices, clever cuisine and all other expenses integrated, making it easy for you to manage your money. I will also introduce life skills courses to the university, which students can enrol in, to help further their self-development and make them more employable. These will include, for example, first aid courses and sign language courses. There is currently a shortage of blood donations in Ireland, yet men who have sex with men are banned from donating. This is unfair and discriminatory. This year I worked with the LGBT Rights Coordinator on the Give Blood Because We Can't campaign. But I want to step this up a notch with a donation, not discrimination campaign to help end this practice. Sometimes people forget that gender encompasses more than the binary male and female and that there is in fact a whole gender spectrum. I will lobby to ensure that at least one gender neutral bathroom is provided on campus for students who need it. I will work with the Disabilities Coordinator to ensure that more campaigns take place on campus in relation to invisible disabilities because these so often get forgotten. I want to completely reform the way sexual health campaigns are run within UCD. I want to ensure that a focus is placed on more informative and engaging ways of educating people on STIs and sexual health and ensure that no student ever feels pressured into having sex. I will ensure that the free condoms available on campus are more readily available through new distribution methods, through RES, the health centre and student advisors. I will also investigate the possibility of bringing in a sponsored U-card operated condom machine where you just swipe your card and your condom is dispensed. I will also guarantee that female condoms and dental dams are available on campus. I've had an amazing experience as a member of the welfare crew for the past three years and I want to get you more involved in your union. I promise to hold open meetings at the beginning of each semester where you can bring forward ideas for your own campaigns which you would like to run and then I'll hold a debriefing session at the end of the semester where I can be held accountable to you. I will also publish a campaigns toolkit online where you can get all the tips and tricks for running your own campaign. You can submit your ideas online and be invited to a campaigning workshop where you'll learn all the skills you need to make your project a reality. Make sure to check out my manifesto or my Facebook page if you want to see more of my ideas. And remember to vote Kira Johnson number one for welfare and equality on the 6th and 7th March. Thank you.